1997, a strange sound echoed from the depths of the Pacific Ocean. It was loud, it was deep, and it was unlike anything scientists had ever recorded, they called it, the bloop. At first, no one could explain it, it didn't match whales, it wasn't a submarine. And it was so powerful, it could be heard over 3,000 miles away. Was it a natural phenomenon? A secret military experiment? Or something living, deep in the abyss? Let's explore one of the greatest deep sea mysteries of all time, and try to uncover the truth behind the blue. In the summer of 1997, the U.S. National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, NOAA, was using underwater microphones, or hydrophones, to monitor the South Pacific. These sensors were originally built during the Cold War to detect submarines, but what they captured that year was not man-made. It was a low-frequency, ultra-powerful sound. It rose rapidly in pitch, lasted for about a minute, and came from a remote point west of the southern tip of South America. They nicknamed it, the Blue. Now here's the wild part, the volume was so intense, multiple sensors picked it up across the entire ocean basin. To be that loud underwater, whatever caused it would have had to be bigger than a blue whale, the largest animal ever known. So naturally, people started asking. What made the blue? First, scientists checked for known animal sounds. Whales, especially blue whales, can produce incredibly loud, low-frequency calls. But the bloop didn't match their pattern. It was different, faster, more abrupt. Next, they considered geological causes. Could it have been an underwater volcano? An earthquake? But again, the bloop didn't match the seismic or volcanic signatures they were used to. There were even whispers of secret naval tests. Some theorized it could have been classified military activity. But if that were true, why was it logged, shared, and published by NOAA? The mystery deepened, and the theories got stranger. Soon, speculation turned to the unknown. Could the bloop have come from some undiscovered giant creature lurking in the deep? After all, the deep ocean is the most unexplored place on Earth. We've mapped more of Mars than we have of the sea floor. Over 80% of our oceans remain unmapped, unobserved, and unimaginably deep. If a creature bigger than any known whale were alive today, hidden beneath miles of pressure and darkness, we probably wouldn't even know it existed. Some people even link the bloop to the works of H.P. Lovecraft, the horror writer who imagined ancient sea monsters like Cthulhu lying dormant beneath the ocean. Was the bloop the first clue that something, huge, is still down there? It was a fun theory. Terrifying, too. But then, after years of mystery, came an answer. At least, a possible one. In 2005, NOAA researchers revisited the bloop, and this time, they had a theory. They believed it was caused by something called icequakes. Yes, icequakes. In Antarctica, massive glacial ice sheets can fracture, crack, or grind together under extreme pressure. When that happens, it can produce seismic sounds, huge, low-frequency booms that travel across the ocean. And the blue? According to NOAA, it closely matched known recordings of icequakes in that region. Case closed. Well, not exactly. While the icequake theory is compelling, not everyone's convinced. For one, the bloop was far louder and more consistent than most recorded icequakes. And it didn't sound like any other known glacial break, it had an organic quality to it. Something almost, alive. And that raises a question. What if the bloop wasn't just one sound, but a type of sound? What if there are other, unknown sources making similar noises in the deep? Even Noah admits, the deep ocean is full of strange, unexplained sounds. Many of them don't fit neat categories. And for every mystery that's solved, more appear. Here's what we do know. The ocean is massive, so vast that new species are discovered every year. There are trenches deeper than Mount Everest is tall. There are creatures that glow, survive without sunlight and withstand crushing pressure. So the idea that we might one day discover a massive, sound-producing life form hiding in the deep? It's not science fiction. It's possibility. And the bloop, real or misinterpreted, reminds us just how little we know. So, what was the bloop? A cracking iceberg? An undiscovered giant? Or something else entirely? Maybe we'll never know for sure. But sometimes, that's what makes it so fascinating. Because the ocean has a way of keeping its secrets. 
and every strange sound from below is a whisper from a world we still haven't fully explored. Until then, the bloop remains one of the greatest, and eeriest, ocean mysteries ever recorded. And who knows? The next sound we hear, might be even stranger. If you enjoyed diving into this mystery, make sure to like the video, subscribe for more deep sea discoveries, and comment below. Do you think the bloop was an animal, an iceberg, or something, else? Until next time, stay curious. And never stop exploring.